to Michelle Franson, Belgium. 21 rod goes in lane three. Jessica Jane Applegate for Great Britain. The defending champion, the fastest seed in the first seat, goes in four. Sweden's Pernilla Lindbergh in five. And for Germany, Janine Brewer makes up the five in heat number one. Jessica Jane Applegate already won a bronze medal at this championship. Canero, Franson, Applegate, Lindbergh and Breuer in this women's 200 freestyle S14. So the fastest eight from the two heats will make it through to a race again in the final. Jessica Jane Applegate, the defending champion, showing her class very early on in this 200 meter race. She was beaten to the silver medal at World Championships last year, so we'll have a point to prove when it comes to the final. But this heat could just be a matter of getting a strong race in, getting a feel for the water. She's already raced now these Paralympic Games picked up a bronze in the 100 meter backstroke. Going well for Belgium. Michelle Franson was second at that turn. And then Lindbergh of Sweden finished fifth in this event. Four years ago, will be looking for a place on the podium. But Applegate, I think uh, when you think back to that race in London four years ago, where she found herself well off the uh, pace and only touching third quickest, but with the final 50, she managed to take two seconds off her personal best. She's a very strong finisher, and with the lead that she's building up at the moment, she's uh, not likely to be caught even in the final if she takes uh, this sort of pace and style and just a little energy. When you get that nervous energy, that good nervous energy, that if you can learn to channel, you can use so effectively come final time. And we see so many swimmers able to better their personal bests They'd be training and swimming these sort of times regularly in training, but in world competition, it's a different story. How do they manage the nerves and the pressure of expectation? But Jessica Jane Applegate has taken all of that away in a very strong swim. She's crushing her opposition in this race, and she's setting a uh, good, solid marker down for the final where she wants to win gold. Well, this is an incredible margin to win a 200-meter race by and this just the heat, so it'll be interesting to see when she comes up against the world record holder in the final. Bethany first yet to come, but it's a comfortable win for Jessica Jane Applegate ahead of Penilla Lindbergh for Sweden, touching in second. 2.07 posted by Applegate. Michelle Franson at a 2.20 to finish in third. Brazil's Beatrice Canero just coming home at the back end of the heat, but it's a new Paralympic record for Jessica Jane Applegate. Still outside of her personal best. Well, Pernilla Lindbergh is uh, delighted with her finish, delighted with her performance. She manages to touch a 2.13. At a personal best of 2.16 before this, so Vanilla Lindbergh of Sweden is excited about the prospect of uh, perhaps a middle winning swim. She's going to be up against some very stiff opposition come uh, the final time. Marlou van der Kolk, Bethany Firth still to come, but indeed Jessica Jane Applegate in the water, the defending champion, looking so strong, and she, she did the hard yards in the opening 50. Uh, such a strong quality finisher didn't need to expend any energy and Jessica Jane Applegate MBE lest we forget one of the New Year's honors in 2013 decorated for her performances in London 2012 
Applegate with the Pearl 